Hey guys, now you've seen a little tease with my Factor 02 here. I've been riding that around for a while, I enjoy it. But today we're here to build a new bike. We're gonna build the VAM from Factor. You can't see much, it's still in the box. But I'm gonna take care of that now. We're gonna build that up today with, with, uh, with VeloFix. I'm gonna head to the bike shop, which is conveniently right outside of my house. See, look, look how long it took me to get to the bike shop. They're right there. What's up? Say hi to the internet. Hey, internet. <laughs> uh, Charlie has a, a shop dog. Charlie, what's the, what's the dog's name? That's Janet. Say hi, Janet. Janet, say hi. All right, Janet's fired. Hi, Janet. It's pretty easy to get her worked up if you just like move around that, that rope or something. No, she's, you know, she's sweet. She's just doing her thing over here. Yeah, it's all right. So because YouTube loves unboxings for some reason, uh, we're going to do that real quick with this guy. I'll let you do the honors, Charlie. It'd be funny if confetti just exploded out of it and I rigged it, but I'm not that smart. Like one of those snakes. Oh, there's my saddle. I put my saddle in there. My bad. Look at that. I love the presentation of that. This is, this is how a bike should arrive. It says... Do not sit on top tube. Are you calling me fat, Factor? Is that what you're saying? You call me fat? I mean, this. The, listen, the top tube is not a chair. That's something that we should all accept. The top tube is not a chair. It's high grade directional carbon fiber. It's stiff in certain directions. And it's not made to be sat on or, uh, you know, punched. So the last, the O2 came with a pizza box and, and so does the, the VAM which it's the worst pizza I've ever had. Ball bearing topping pizza. I do not recommend. All right, but Charlie's got all the new Axis parts. I told you I was saving the Axis for the for the the geeky light bike. You got everything you need, right? I do. All right, Charlie's all set. Um, I'm going to go ride I'm going to go ride around on the other bike and uh, we'll come back and check on you. Great. Sweet. Yeah, see you in a bit. All right, peace. Now, while VeloFix is building up my Factor VAM, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about my Factor O2. The O2, uh, I've had that for a little over a couple months now. I knew the VAM was gonna come, so I figured the O2 was gonna be my workhorse. Um, so I got it with disc brakes. I do, I train on disc brakes pretty much exclusively. I live in LA. The hills are steep um, on the rare occasion that it rains. It's real slippery because all the diesel never gets washed away, but the one time it rains a year. Oh man, it's nice up here. Oh, this is a workhorse bike, but it's still, it's a climbing bike. Like that's what Factor does with the O2 is it's a light bike. Honestly, like it's a lot faster than I would have thought. It's a lot lighter than I would have thought for a disc brake bike. Um, I think it's just over 16 pounds. And like, I didn't build it up to be light. You know, I've got like, I have all my carbon geeky crap on here. I didn't have the VAM for about a month and I had, I found myself like getting KOMs on the disc brake bike, which I never would have tried really on other disc bikes. Uh, just cause like, I know they're a little heavier, but it's a light bike, goes uphill, awesome. I mean, this is a world tour guys race this bike. It works very well. And uh, yeah, I've, I've been enjoying it. I've gotten, I've gotten long KOMs on it. I've gotten short KOMs on it. Uh, I built it up with the, with the SRAM 11 speed, you know, I'm a dinosaur. I built it up with the regular red E-Tap. I got my quirk on here. I got the regular ISM saddle, not the crazy carbon one. I've got the Mavic uh, UST wheels, which I've really been enjoying. They talk about it for, for flat prevention for the whole tubeless thing, but they corner nice. Like honestly, one of the best performing tires I've, I've used. That's kind of my little review of the O2. Uh, it works for the hills and uh you know in both directions and i'm still i'm still able to win the group ride on on the workhorse bike the uh i just ride one-handed this is don't try this at home this is best reserved for professional uphill riding one-handed is fine it flattened out here and now i'm sketched out factor they they do a good job everything's everything's together they're they've been around for a while they know what they're doing there's no growing pains it's super legit from manufacturing to, to presentation to uh to rideability 
You guys, my arm is so sore from that. <laughs> I'm just holding like a quarter pound camera. I need to hit the gym soon. It's obviously I couldn't, yeah, I need to hit the gym. I'll be all right. All right, so the ride's done. Back at my, at my bike shop. <laughs> that looks like a bike, huh? We've got, we got SRAM axis. We're going 12 speed with this guy, but I've got the double rings because I still go fast sometimes and I want my extra gear options. The ISM, the full carbon saddle. I love this integrated handlebar thing. Charlie, tell me if I'm in your way. No, not at all. <laughs> the integrated handlebar and then they've got this nice mount for, it's either compatible with the Garmin or a Wahoo and it looks clean. Uh, ceramic speed bearings. That's, that's just stock with, with all the factor stuff. Look how, look at that fork. Carbon direct mount brakes, right? Mm -hmm. um, and then here, right now we've got the Mavic UST. Uh, we've got the tubeless carbon wheels set up. For, for the hill climb, I will have the tubular, which are a little bit lighter. All right, now we're also, we're using the, the Element Bolt, which is uh, smaller and lighter. I, I didn't do that right. <laughs> okay, well, we, we'll fix that. See what she weighs here. Without the race wheels, these are the, the tubeless. Oh, you got it? I couldn't do that. Oh, well, that's my fault. 14.1. That's not bad. That's not bad. What do you think, Janet? Okay, she doesn't care. Well, I think it's great. Sorry, Janet. Uh, I'm looking forward to riding this thing at the hill climb, and uh, I'll tell you guys more about it later. Peace.